Hello everyone. Welcome to Catch the Concept. Today, let us have a brief discussion on Tosca Automation tool. What is Tosca Automation? Tosca is a software testing tool that is used to automate end-to-end -end testing of end-to-end -end testing for software applications. Along with automation testing, Tosca also supports manual testing. Tosca is a code-free tool. So we don't need any coding knowledge or any scripting knowledge to automate test cases in Tosca. Okay. Okay, let us move on to differences of different type of automation tools. Okay, so as we all know, we have UFT, Selenium, and uh, Tosca. So type, if you see, uh, UFT is a licensed space tool and Tosca is also licensed space. Selenium, yeah, we all know Selenium is open source tool, so we don't need any license. And cost, if you see the cost comparison, uh, UFT is low cost tool and uh, Selenium is free yeah, since it's an open source. And Tosca is a moderate, yeah, we can say moderate cost. Uh, and uh, types of applications that are different type of tools that allows. So UFT uh, is compatible for web and desktop applications. And Selenium can automate only web-based applications. And if you see Tosca, Tosca can automate any kind of application. So example, web application, desktop application, and uh, mobile application, API application, any kind of application can be automated by using Tosca application and Tosca tool. So what are the different scripting languages that are used in different tools? UFT needs VB scripting knowledge and the Selenium needs Java coding knowledge. And Tosca is a model-based tool, so that's why I don't need any scripting language or scripting, any script, any coding, nothing is required. So we just have to drag and drop the modules and we can automate it. Yeah, we will discuss that. So that is a brief discussion on Tosca. And uh, Tricentis Corporation has been developed the Tosca automation tool. Tricentis the corporation which has been developed with this Tosca automation tool. Okay, let us uh, see what all sections are available in the Tosca. Yeah, so Tosca, in Tosca, we will be seeing six sections. One is uh, test cases, modules, requirements, test case design, execution, and issues. So these six sections Tosca will provide. So in these six sections only we will work. The complete automation process will be uh, captured. Uh, our complete process will be tracked in these six sections. Uh, first thing is the test cases, we will create the test cases. Uh, and uh, in the modules, we will add all the objects and we will drag those objects to the test cases and we will develop the scripts. And requirement section is used for writing the requirements or stories, whatever stories we have, we will uh, write those stories here. And we can link those stories with the test cases as well as the exhibition. And if you see test case design, test case design, tab is used to maintain the test data, okay? And exhibition. In exhibition, we will first create all the test cases in the test case section. And once the test case is uh, completely prepared, then we will move the test cases. We will drag those test cases and drop it in the exhibition. And we will run the we will run the exhibition from exhibition tab so that we can analyze the results here in this section. And uh, what is issues? 
if you see any defects or any issues in the execution, if something is failing, then we can go to issues tab and we can create the defects here. Just to know, we can just right click on the issues and we'll be having the option to create the defect. And we can click on here and we can create the defects. So these are the six sections that Tosca provides. Okay, so you must be understanding now what are the different uh, sections that Tosca provides. So I can simply show how to today, I'll just, I'm planning to discuss how to open the URL. So if you want to open any URL, how to open it. So first we have to create one test case. So I'm right clicking on the test case main folder and I'm clicking on create test case. This is the icon for create test case. And here I'm just, you know, giving the test case name. Test case name is opening Google website. Okay. So how to open the Google website? Uh, so in Tosca, Tosca provides one module uh, to open the URL. How to, how to use that. So once after creating the test case, you can just right click on the test case and you can go here, step and add test step. Search, sorry, search and add test step. So you can just click on this, search and add test step. It will show all the standard modules which Tosca provides. You can just you know, search with open URL. Yeah, so this is the one which which is used this is the module which will be used to open the any url okay so this is one and i just have to give the url there so for the google so google url i'll just copy it from here and i'll paste it here so this is google url i have just Copy it and paste it here. So we just have to give the value. What is the URL we have? We are uh, like you know want we wanted to open. So we have to give that URL so that Tosca will identify the URL and it will open the browser and it will open this URL. So so this is this is how we can open the URL. So we just have to give the URL here. So let me close this browser completely and run it i'm just opening this right click on the test case just right click on the test case and run in scratch book we just have to run it in scratch book and see now google website will be opened see google web page is open now in the same way if you want to open facebook you can also open the facebook in the same way i'll just let me show it to you uh, you can just change this url whatever url you want you can just have you just have to give that url here yeah. So I'm just giving now Facebook. So now it will be, yeah, you can just see www.facebook.com. So you can, yeah, now you can see that Facebook page will be opened. It will open the browser and it will open the Facebook website. Yeah, let us see. Yeah, yeah, you can see now Facebook is opening. Yeah, Facebook is open. So Tosca opened the Facebook website here. So this is how we will open the URL. Yeah, 
So that is how, uh, yeah, we, if you want to open a new URL, we just have to use the open URL module here by clicking on the uh, test case, you'll be having search and add test step. And we'll go there and we'll, we'll search with the open URL. And we will, once that, uh, if you click on this open URL, you'll be getting a test step added here. So we will call this as a test step. We'll call this as a test step. So once the test step is added, we just have to give the URL, what are the URL you wanted to open. You can just mention it here and you can just save the test case and you can just right click on it and run the run in scratch book. It will automatically open that URL, whatever you mention in the value, URL value. Yeah, that's all about how to open the URL and a brief introduction on the different sections of Tosca. Okay, thank you for watching this video. Yeah, we'll see you soon in the another video. Please like, share, subscribe our channel. Thank you.